This is Dr. Stephen Daniel, the co-founder of QuantumTechniques.com, the most comprehensive form of energy medicine and diagnostics practice anywhere in the world. And we do this remotely over the phone every day. I previously did um, a YouTube video on CBD oil as an alternative for anxiety and depression medications. We've had such a large response to that, I wanted to go into that a little bit more and give people feedback that are related to all the phone calls and the emails I've had. So first of all, um, CBD oil is a whole food derivative. It is the hemp plant. Okay? It's responsible for uh, giving our body cannabinoids. And they're finding now that the body has more cannabinoid receptor sites than any other type or all other types combined. Now that means the body produces a lot of its own cannabinoids and that makes them work on the cell service receptor. We do know that hemp oil gives you high doses of that. And I want to share two resources. One, there's a company called HempLandUSA.com. I've used their product. It is a very high quality product. If you contact them, they would send you a little booklet called I Want My CBD. And it's just informative about all the things from depression, anxiety, pain, insomnia, ADD, cancer, gut issues that CBD oil is highly effective for. Okay. Another resource is a newsletter by Frank Schallenberger, Alternative Doctor. He's got a great article, the newsletter is called Second Opinion, going into depth and research on this. And you can email him at feedback at secondopinionnewsletter.com if you have questions that, that go beyond this YouTube video. So we know that cannabinoids are naturally occurring in our body. We know that they're fantastic for many health issues, but when marijuana got criminalized, they criminalized all hemp plants too for a while because they really couldn't distinguish looking which was which. They only could do that with a lab test. Okay, cannabinoids have no THC. That means that they don't make you high. That's why they're legal in all 50 states. Okay, so couple of notes I have. Um, the other thing about them is since they're a whole food supplement, if you're taking pain meds or, in, or medication for sleep or anxiety or depression, taking cannabinoids oil, the CBD oil, will not harm you. It will not have a negative interaction with your medication. Okay, it's a whole food, so if it's going to be very helpful, it's going to do nothing. And you either have to have us test you or you have to try that to find out. Okay. Um, another thing is I've had some people with severe pain issues just be able to use the oil topically where the pain is. Most people take it orally twice a day. Um, again, two good companies, Hempland USA, BluebirdBotanicals.com.